Aries. This is y'all weekly message. Aries, thank y'all for rocking with me. Thank y'all for fucking with me. Um, I'll be offering some memberships soon. The apparel will be up as well on Etsy. And get ready. There is some great opportunities coming. Since y'all rocking with the white butterfly. So, um, somebody went to jail. Somebody could have a background, penitentiary background. Someone, um, could have had a gun charge, fighting a gun charge. Somebody is realizing that you literally are God. Somebody's been contemplating suicide. Please get help. Whatever it is, it ain't that serious. Nothing is that serious that you should end your life. I think I really had enough. So whatever you're going through, you're going through it. You're going through some things right now. There's some things that are not selling for you right now. Somebody been taking more painkillers, trying to numb the pain. Someone has been praying a lot. Someone is realizing that, well, the math ain't mathing. And since that's being told to you, it got told me by Kevin Gates. This is somebody that could be a hood. I'm hearing a hood ninja. So this is a hood person. You know, they could be living in a the hood. They could have been brought up in a hood. Somebody's a Gemini as well. Aquarius too. Um, somebody has been dealing with players. Someone that has You've been dealing with someone that is no longer that special person in your life anymore. This is someone you could have known from back in the day. And I'm hearing you cutting ties with a particular person that you knew from back in the day. You are ending cycles. Okay. Force could be significant. Somebody could be 43. Somebody could be 44. Y'all could be seeing a number 44 a lot. Well, let's grow. Well, let's grow. Different. Y'all might be about to collab collaborate with somebody. I'm going to give y'all some money tips for the week. It's time for you to change your focus. You focus on the wrong things. You focus on things that no longer serves you. And I split the deck again. Collaborate. So y'all been thinking about collaborating with somebody. Or y'all want to collaborate with somebody. Or y'all going to be collaborating with somebody this week. Let's see. Let's see what you got. Aries. So somebody might be thinking about making some type of earl. 
Somebody could be working on a laptop. Somebody could work from home. And, um... If you are already running a business, get testimonies from your clients. Get testimonies from the clients so they can help with that word of mouth. You need to look at your reviews, check on your reviews. How many happy customers you got? You need to work on um, stay in a high frequency. You might need to um, spray like lavender around, like some lavender, um, some lavender incense. You got an audience, so. I'm here and I'm giving something to talk about. Research the market that you're trying to go into. Somebody could be a photographer. Somebody could have a photo shoot coming up. Somebody might need to have a photo shoot. You need to, um, somebody's an Aquarius caught up in a rapture. Somebody's caught up in your love rapture. I'm hearing you got me caught up in your love cycle. Um Love Cycle by I don't know what's his name. Coding or something, I don't know. But Love Cycle. I think it might be uh Tusi. Um We need to Write down your ideas. Get permission to use people names. Or the username. Because you know nobody ever use their real name these days. That's how you don't know who people is. Because people be hiding who they truly is. Make sure that your business. You have a, um, a good business. Um, a, a certificate of fact is what it's called. You may need a certificate of fact. When it comes to your business, you get that from the state that you formed your business at. Look, I am my own guru. I am my own guru, a joy premeditated mother. Somebody could be a Leo. Somebody could have been uh, prophesied something. See that line right there? Somebody can have color eyes, green eyes. Somebody can have brown eyes. Somebody third eye chakra is open. I am my own guru. I know the self that never changes. I know the self that never changes. I call my power back from all times and all places. I am my own. So you are calling your own power back, calling your power back because you learn some type of lesson. You learn some type of lesson and you might be on your own. You might be branching out, branching out to be on your own or by yourself. You might be leaving stepping in your true power you have you can't gotten some type of epiphany some type of awakening something with a fine look I said Leo somebody wants to marry or give a Leo a commitment this could have been somebody that was a player but somebody's caught up in your rapture of love I'm hearing love bug. You somebody love bug, child. Look, you somebody empress. So somebody had to make a difficult decision. 
after they was backstabbed and betrayed from an empress. They could have been backstabbed and betrayed from a baby mother. They might have had to make a decision between a baby mother. You could be seeing 555 this week. Somebody found out somebody was lying. Let's see, we got lions and tigers. Y'all definitely dealing with a, um, a Leo. Somebody got a Leo in their chart. But there's some type of ending to a cycle. It could be ending to a cycle with a, um, a baby mother. See, somebody wants to smoke. Somebody's ending the relationship with a baby mama because it's been too stressful and put too much burdens on a person, too much responsibilities on a particular person. They put these burdens and responsibilities on this particular person and it has caused a lot of friction, a lot of chaos in a home situation. See, there's a tower moment coming because somebody's about to be heartbroken. So it was a difficult decision with somebody because somebody was somebody was um somebody didn't expect this tower moment to take place. Somebody was broken hearted, so that's why they had to leave a particular situation. And there's three tens out here, so there's major endings of a cycle. Could be a third party situation that went on. Somebody wants to have a stable and get a stable commitment to somebody they want to reconciliate with. Could be a biracial couple. Could be two different, somebody a red bone, somebody could be brown skinned, somebody could have naturally curly hair, somebody could have dreads. There is a ending to a backstabbing cycle. There is an ending to the um inconsistency. There's an ending to something with something is gonna be illuminated this week. You got good news coming after the cycle is ending. Somebody's about to come and give you good news after some type of stress in a family in a family situation. Some type of burdens are being lifted. See, judgment has been made. Look, somebody was toxic. Somebody's ending the cycle, somebody that's toxic, somebody that's manipulative, somebody that's devilish, somebody that's been pour, pulling a lot of strings. Somebody could wear MAC makeup, then I say Leo. So somebody could have gotten some type of epiphany after being away from a particular person. Someone could have gotten an epiphany after doing some soul searching, after being ghosted. There is definitely cycles ending. Cycles ending, getting out of this head, getting out of the, um, getting out of your head, Feeling tired and bound to a situation. Something that's going to blindside you. Or something already blindsided you. Something that you didn't expect to happen. Someone is trying to protect you. Or being protective of you. Balancing out the scales.
there's some type of celebration that's going to happen this week with collaborating with somebody. The scales are about to be balanced out. See? There it goes. Okay, so I split the deck. So we got Aries, Energy, Ace of Wands, Chariot, and we got Justice card. So you got Justice coming for a particular situation. Somebody's been planning this. They got success and victory coming with a particular situation. There is forward movement and a stable offer coming. Somebody might be going to the club. You give somebody paradise. You give me paradise. Aries. Cancer. Something could have been significant about 2016. But whoever was going against you, whoever was um, going against you in a particular situation, it's about to be sh shown. Aries, that's, your, that's you. And got the number eight. So there is forward movement. Capricorn, Gemini, Taurus, Cancer, Scorpio, 10, and 1. So there's definitely confirmation there is an ending coming. Y'all going to see a lot of 10s this week, and y'all could see a lot of 3s. Because 3 is significant, significant because somebody has put someone in a third-party situation. This third-party situation that someone put someone in, there's a decision being made. Okay. Thank y'all for rocking with me. I love y'all. Y'all be easy.